Hi, I'm Brian Dunbar of Greg's Airbrush, and I travel to model shows across the country, and I'm often asked about paint and thinning products. So let's talk about some of these products that we utilize in our hobby. We have enamels and metalizers, which are petroleum-based products. We also utilize acrylics, which can be either water or alcohol-based. For many of these products, they have a formulated thinning agent, but they're also cheaper generic products that are available on the market that can also be utilized for thinning or for cleaning purposes. So let's discuss these products in closer detail. This is Testers, which is our standard for enamel paints in our hobby. We have the square bottled paints that many of us are familiar with. And we also have the Model Master paints, which are uh, geared for military specific colors. You have the formulated thinner, which is appropriate, of course, for your thinning of the paints for airbrush use. We also have lacquer thinner, which is appropriate for cleaning of the airbrush once you've completed your project. We have here Tamiya and Javi, uh, Gunzi Javi Color products. Both of these products are acrylics, but they are alcohol based. You do not want to utilize distilled water with these products. Tamiya makes their own proprietary thinner. With Gunzi, we have 90% isopropyl alcohol, which you can actually utilize for both these products to good effect. And again, you can utilize the alcohol for cleaning purposes. This is Floquil, which traditionally speaking has been considered a lacquer-based paint, but since the reformulation without xylene, which is harmful, it is now considered to perform more like that of an enamel paint. They have their own formulation for their thinner, but you can again use the cheaper lacquer thinner for cleaning purposes. Moving back once again to testers and their Model Master line, they have produced an acrylic line as well. However, unlike Tamiya paints, which you would thin with alcohol, this line you would use distilled water or their proprietary thinning agent. They've also provided a cleaning agent as well. Basically, they're the same product, but the cleaning agent's just a little bit hotter in its formulation for cleaning the, your airbrush once you're done with this product. Moving to Italeri, this is a new product line on the market. Once again, they formulated their own thinning agent, but this, again, like the Testers line, is a water-based product. Lastly, with the metalizers that I wish to discuss, we have the Alclad 2 line and, once again, Model Master and Testers. These products do not require thinning, as they are high-viscosity products that flow nicely through the airbrush for your natural metal finishes. Alclad 2 does provide their own cleaning agent. However, you can utilize the lacquer thinner once again for either the Alclad 2 or the Model Master lines to clean your airbrush once you're finished using these products. Now that we've discussed some of these products in our hobby, in our next video we're going to discuss thinning and how it applies to our airbrushing.